EastEnders Sharon Watts is set to move on from her heartbreak with Keanu Taylor with a new love interest on the BBC soap, and it's a familiar face. The iconic character, played by Letitia Dean, has had numerous romantic entanglements since her first appearance on the BBC One soap in 1985. Recently, she was left heartbroken following the death of her fiancé Keanu Taylor, who was killed by Linda Carter after he tried to strangle Sharon upon discovering that her son Albie wasn't his. Last week saw Keenus' funeral take place, leaving Sharon devastated. However, sparks soon flew between Sharon and her ex-lover and father of her baby, Phil Mitchell. Despite trying to dismiss their passionate kiss, it appears Sharon will soon have a new admirer. This week introduces a new Mitchell family, Billy's brother Teddy and his two children, Harry and Barney. Spoilers suggest that Teddy will develop feelings for Sharon next week. After a messy Mitchell drinking session at the gym leaves Sharon unimpressed, Teddy attempts to win her over with an invitation for a drink and some smooth talking, reports My London. Teddy and Sharon engage in a playful drink, which earns a suspicious glance from Stevie who is uncomfortable with his son's interaction with Phil's ex. When Teddy attempts to persuade Sharon to continue their drinking session, she jovially brushes him off and departs. Roland Manukian, acknowledged for his roles in the Football Factory, Rockin' Rollo and the Rise of the Foot Soldier franchise, has assumed the character of Teddy. Elijah Holloway portrays Harry while Lewis Bridgman enacts younger brother Barney. Chris Clenshaw, executive producer, expressed his pleasure in welcoming the new members, I'm delighted to welcome Roland, Elijah and Lewis to EastEnders as we bring a new branch of the iconic Mitchell family to the square. He continued, the arrival of Teddy, Harry and Barney will be a seismic shock for Billy and an unwelcome surprise for Phil. With their arrival sparking more questions than answers, it's not long before the Mitchells find themselves at war as Teddy and his sons are thrust into the heart of the drama.